Hello everyone, this is Christopher with One Tech Stop. Now today I'm going to bring you a comparison of two rather contrasting Lumia devices, the most highest end, the Lumia 950XL, against the lowest end, the Lumia 435. Uh, it would be very easy to dismiss this comparison and say it would be completely one-sided in favor of the Lumia 950 XL. I mean, just let's just look at the specification. The 950 XL is running on the newer version of Windows Phone, that is Windows 10 Mobile, against uh, Windows Phone 8.1 on the 435. You have a Qualcomm Snapdragon 810 CPU on here, which is uh, a 2 gigahertz octa-core. CPU, I believe, against the 1.2 gigahertz dual core Snapdragon 200. And the GPUs, whether this means much to you, uh, it's the Adreno 430 on the 950XL and it's the Adreno 302 on the 435. So if the numbers are anything to go by, this has a much better graphics processing unit. Uh, one thing to bear in mind though, uh, displays. 2560 by 1440 here on the 950 XL, only 480 by 800 here, so a lot more work for the processor to do. It's got a 2K display, all those pixels and everything it's got to load. But will that make a difference? Well, let's have a look. First of all, we're going to shut down any open apps in the background. first thing we want to test is the camera and start up times of the camera now you can launch the camera by pressing the camera button but there isn't one on the 435 so to do it fairer we'll do it from the drag down notification center three two one okay it is all ready to go here on the 950 xl the 435 launched a little bit after few seconds in it I'd say noticeable especially if you're in a hurry to take a picture okay, next we'll go into the calculator three two one uh, pretty much the same sort of time I think on that one there is a much more fully featured calculator here on the 950XL with all these options you can convert speed area etc well here on the 950xl you have a standard calculator flip it into landscape and it becomes a scientific calculator okay the next thing we'll test is something probably every most people use on a smartphone is the web browser and we'll load up a new private tab and go to our website I should of course say they're both running on the same Wi-Fi network. Actually, we might also want to check that both are set. Thing mobile version, mobile version. I hope you can see that there. Right, anyway, back to onetechstop.net. Okay. Three, two, one. Uh, look pretty close to me not a huge amount in it I'll go to the second post on the list uh, the third post on the list let's see how they get on okay one two three Uh, that was actually a win there for the 435 by about a second. So, very well done. We'll click on that image and see which one loads the image first. Three, two, one. Okay, that was definitely the 
950XL. Okay, we'll go to another website. Owen is one I visit quite often. Okay, three, two, one. Oh, actually, again, a 435 loaded the page quicker. And we'll load the second article. Three, two, one. Again, oh, well, that was pretty much neck and neck on that one. We can try loading maps. They do, of course, run a different version of maps, I believe, on Windows 10 Mobile to Windows Phone 8.1. Okay, three, two, one. Pretty much similar, I'd say. Not a huge amount in it. I'd say it is quite a bit smoother on the 950XL, as to be expected. Okay, one more test. Cortana from the search button. Okay, work. Well, Cortana is difficult to work because I'm not actually signed in on this phone. Which one opens up the store first of all? Three, two, one. Well, okay, in the end, they all loaded the images at both about the same sort of time. They are two different app stores with different layouts. We'll do a search on both. Let's see. Difference being this actually comes up with a suggested app, whereas this one stays blank. Well, that'll make a difference. Three, two, one. Okay, definitely quicker on the 950XL. And lastly, we'll try weather. Three, two, one okay that was a fair bit faster on the 950xl they're not identical apps actually uh the 435 uses this pivot system while hamburger menus are on the 950xl which may actually make things a little faster for the 435. And lastly, we will see what restores apps from the background quicker. Now, personally, I would say looking at the app switching screen, I think I kind of prefer this old style of just going horizontal left to right with them all lined up rather than having four here. It, it just kind of gets a bit confusing when Sometimes it's easier to see anyway, right, which will reload maps quicker. Okay, definitely the 950XL there, a lot faster. What about the store? Again, this, uh, no need to refresh on here. Not on these occasions, at least. It just went straight back into it. We'll go to the web browser. Okay, three, two, one. Okay, pretty good, pretty close. And finally, the calculator. Both pretty much identical. Actually, we'll just try the camera as well if it 
Okay, then 435 there to do a fair bit of resuming before it was ready. All right, well, that is the end of my comparison of David and Goliath. And just as in that biblical story, uh, David actually won a couple on this one. It was it loaded web pages faster, probably down to the fact that it's only got 480 by 800 uh, pixels to load, whereas this has got 2K, uh, 2560 by 1440 to reload every time. Okay, comments and questions are always welcome. Uh, if you have anything you'd ask, anything you'd like to know, please leave them in the comments section or find us on Twitter. Our links will be in the description box. So this is Chris for One Tech Stop and thanks ever so much for watching.